Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So yes, first of all, I'm going to address the elephant in the room. I am wearing pajamas and that's because I am trying to get in the Christmas spirit. Also, it is nighttime. Also, this is more of a relaxed video, so I thought it was okay. I thought it was appropriate. And if you're wondering, my pajamas do have um, some kittens on them playing with yarn and it says knitting on it and um, they have some holiday, mit holiday mittens. No, they have like mittens and like stuff like that and they're cute and they're just they're they're precious okay but the point of today's video is that i'm going to be doing a mask so i kind of wanted to start this like series ish type thing on my channel and call it masks with maddie um and so basically i just like come on here and apply a mask tell you how it's gonna do tell you how it did for my skin stuff like that i do have some that will be like first impressions but other than that i did want to come on and just show you guys some masks that i do already have um, what they do for my skin, if I think they're worth purchasing or not, because some of the other ones I have had for a while, and I can tell you if they're good or not. So, yes, I wanted to kind of do this at least once a month. I feel like that would be kind of fun. Today's mask is going to be the e.l.f. Marshmallow Soothing Mask. Now, I have been wanting to try this one for a while, so this is going to be a first impression, and I'm super excited about it. So I have it pulled up on e.l.f.'s website right now, and it is um, $10, but they always kind of always have a sale going on so you can almost find it for like cheaper i haven't been able to find this at ulta or walmart or target i don't know if they sell it in those stores yet um but i did purchase mine online when they were having a black friday sale i'm just gonna read the details and um some of the ingredients so it says this is a soothing clay mask that calms the skin with a nourishing layer of the rich opaque clay gel hybrid formula it's infused with coconut water, kaolin clay, and shea butter, and it will leave your skin feeling supple, soft, and soothed. So it says that kaolin clay will control your excessive oils, that shea butter is nourishing, and then the coconut water will moisturize and soothe. Um, it's free from parabens, sulfates, and phthalates. I hate that word. I can't ever say it. Apply an even layer to clean, dry skin, avoiding the eyes and lip areas. You're going to leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes, then rinse well with warm water. And you can use this up to three times per week. And then it says, here's a little beauty tip. It says, apply your mask down your neck to soothe and nourish all visible skin. Um, other than that, I did want to say this is um, kind of a newer mask to e.l.f. And this little packaging here, it looks so small, but it's pretty heavy. Um... There is 1.76 ounces in here, or 50 grams, and once you open it up, it has this little plastic piece right here that you just take off, and then inside is your mask. I'm not sure that you'll be able to see that because of the lighting. Um, it honestly doesn't look like there's a lot of product in here. Like, you could do this mask a couple times, and then you'd have to repurchase it. Face. So I do have my e.l.f. Um, what is this even called? It's like their mask tool. I bought this a while ago because I hate... I just I needed something to apply masks with other than like a brush that I'd have to clean all the time and this is like a nice little um it's just nice and I totally recommend it okay so I'm just going in and I'm going to put this on my face an even layer and I do have clean skin okay so the mask is on this is what it's looking like, white, and it does feel actually pretty cooling, which is interesting. Again, I feel like I did kind of use quite a bit of the product. I'm not really sure if you can see that, but I feel like that was a good chunk of the product. And I didn't put like a ton on my skin. It's not that thick of a layer. It's just an even layer. So it says leave on to ten for 10 to 15 minutes, and I'm going to do that right now. All right, guys, so I am back, and the verdict is in. Um... I like this mask. I think it was really nice. It felt really hydrating and like kind of cooling on my skin while I had it on and it was drying. Um, it wasn't the hardest mask, like clay mask to wash off ever, but I did, um, it did take me a minute. So it, it wasn't just like put water on my face and it was gone. It, it did take a minute of like kind of scrubbing it off, like getting it off, but it wasn't the most difficult one to get off. Um, looking at my skin now, it looks really like I don't know. It looks like it has like this nice glow to it. Like, like it looks hydrated. It looks good. Even though I have like blemishes and like spots on it, it still looks good. And call me crazy, but my pores are like non-existent now. And I have pores. I have existent pores. I know I have existent pores. But like now, they don't exist. 
and I'm kind of confused because it didn't say that it was going to do anything for my pores. For $10, I think this mask is pretty great if you were looking to try it out. Maybe, um, hopefully this video either helped you um, want to go purchase it or helped you not want to go purchase it. Either one just helped you in general. Again, thank you guys so much for watching this video. That is all I have for you guys today. I hope you are having a blessed day or night wherever you are, and I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye!